And as the Niger brand cheek trade fair kicks off in Ikeja, the Lagos state government has expressed hope of realizing not less than 5 billion naira in sales from the fair. A thousands of residents engaged in buying and selling. Special advisor to Governor Sonwulu on tourism, arts and culture, Idris Arigbe, who stated this at the opening ceremony of the trade fair, noted that this will greatly improve the state's economy. Arigbe described the partnership with other sponsors as a huge success for micro, small and medium entrepreneurs and assured them, especially the youth of Governor Sonwulu's administration's commitment to the case of doing for the ease of doing business in this state. The convener of NBC Trade Fair, Nelly Agbogu, who thanked the Lagos State Government for supporting MSMEs, expressed excitement that traders at the fair were cashing out in millions despite their economic meltdown. Similarly, the Yalaja Odua Princess Toy Kolade commended the Lagos State Government for creating an enabling environment for business to thrive in the state. It's about growing our economy. Is about, is about going economy, is about expanding the scope of the Ministry of Tourism. That we're not just about dance, music, art. Well, you know, it's now a serious business. And that's more reason why we must, you know, we have agreed to go on strategic alliance to make sure that, you know, we identify with key partners, key brands. You know, Lagos State Government is not in competition with any brand. Rather, what we're supposed to do is complement and see how we can, you know, identify those partners and, and, and work on it, and that's what we're doing today. That's also about the Songo Naira. So the Songo Naira is also another initiative that we put, you know, we plug into this, just to make sure that, you know, um, you, you know that our, our, you know, our government, my governor, our governor, your governor cares about the people, and that's what we're saying today. So it's about supporting them, you know, subsidizing some of, this, some of those key items here as well. It's about also looking for ways to also engage the people, also support them and see, just to add value to them. To, to, to value to them. You know, it's also, you know, Salah is also around the corner. It's also another way of my governor saying right. thank you to Lagosians and all that. This is the first time we, um, we had such an amount. Usually we have like 2,000 to 3,000. But with the partnership with Lagos State Tourism, it blew over to over 10,000. And we were really amazed because the truth is that we have never had this amount of people begging to have their products and services exhibited. And this is thanks to Lagos State Tourism for every single thing that has happened. This partnership has been one of the best things that has happened to our, our fair and you can see how the amount of people coming in. Today we have seen people cry because they have never... Imagine selling what you will sell in three months in one day. I don't know if you understand it. In this economy, and it can only be in Lagos, only in Lagos. It's, um, it's been a wonderful experience. As you can see, the atmosphere is large, the crowd is large. The vendors are large and um, they are quite friendly. Also, they have friendly prices. So I would, um, I would encourage Lagosians to please come over to the Niger Brand Chick Fair and get a taste of um, good prices for quality products. This is the first time we, um, we had such an amount. Usually we have like 2,000 to 3,000. But with the partnership with Lagos State Tourism, it blew over to over 10,000. And we were really amazed because the truth is that we have never had this amount of people begging to have their products and services exhibited. And this is thanks to Lagos State Tourism for every single thing that has happened. This partnership has been one of the best things that has happened to our, our fair. And you can see how the amount of people coming in.